Hello, welcome back to my channel. It's David here. Today we're going to be making a little quick, well not that quick, but fairly quick art project. This is a paint pour and I'm sure you guys have seen plenty of YouTube videos. If not, check, check out some links below in my description box. I love watching the mixed media girl. Her pours turned out so good. Anyways, Today I was really inspired to create a pour, but I also wanted to create like kind of a geometric natural organic shape, which I really, really love geode rocks. Um, so I got like my inspiration from like a geode. Anyways, I'm mixing up the paint and right here, I'm going to show you. So I'm using about three parts of Elmer's glue to one part paint. And then I use Flow Trawl, which you can find that at Lowe's or Home Depot or Menards or anything like that. And I just dump some in there so that it's able to flow onto the canvas better. So yeah, the paint ends up being like a squirt or two of the paint. Just depends on how like dark you want it because it does kind of lighten up the color a little bit, I feel like, when you mix it in there. And... Right now, like how I just ran away, I actually just added a little bit of water into the mixture just so it was a little runnier so it's able to really flow on the canvas. And this is a clean as you go type of situation here. Now once you have all of your paints mixed up, we're going to take an empty cup and just start pouring all the paints into this cup, like one by one. I did random, I didn't do like a, a certain type of sequence, I just randomly poured the color in there. Now it's time to start pouring. I don't recommend doing what I just did, just because you're going to have lines where you just poured. So you might want to start off like pouring into the middle. As you can see, I did not have enough paint. So I ended up using my hand to kind of just make it flow off the edges a little better. Which end up kind of ruining most of the work, honestly. That's okay though. I end up going over this whole thing with a paintbrush. And here is the results of the paintbrush. Just all the colors mixed together, but I did end up mixing some, up some more paint and individually pouring out how I wanted my shape to be. Like I said, I was inspired by a geode rock, so I really wanted this really unique like line structure going kind of from one side of the canvas to the other. And then I thought that the background was just a bit too plain for me, so I did sprinkle on just a few random colors, just some dots, and add to it. I end up creating another one, and then you'll just let these dry, sitting flat like that, away from your cats, of course, and you have a one-of-a-kind, unique art piece you can hang on your wall. You guys are welcome. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel to get more of these fun projects.